Good evening, good evening, good evening. We are here on another of our live and just want to say good evening to each and every one. Wherever you are, good evening, Candice Chin, good evening to you. Big up yourself. Good evening, folks. Yes. So let me just show you guys immediately what we are doing. And Carol Bar Barfield, good evening to you. Big up, Saint. Good evening to you. Guys, if you want to see my quick and easy steam fish, give us a thumbs up. DeAndre Small, big up yourself. Yeah, big up yourself. The wifey is in charge of the kitchen this evening. I'm the official camera person for today's broadcast yeah so let me just show you guys what's going on and you know what steam fish is something that most jamaicans know how to do without even questioning it's just it's just so easy and most of tadia johnson good evening most of our steam fish um just have to do with the preparation so the quick and easy does the quick and easy involve the preparation? Because the preparation is most of it, right? Mm -hmm. But the preparation is not hard either. Fred, it is snapper fish, yes, but we have butterfly them. We have bought them from our fishmonger and they are butterflied. All right? So, um, yes, yeah, show them the, the, fact, the fact that they're butterflied there. They have um, removed the bones and opened the fish up so alma good evening to you yellow belly how you do girl big up yourself yes 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 simone kelly good evening to you and all the other folks out there yes man so we are going to make a quick and easy steam fish you just took away my bird paper I've never done this, but me I gotta learn today. Top max, big up yourself. <laughs> First thing, top max, you have to you have a butterfly fish, which means cut off the head, slice it down the middle, take out the bones, and you know prepare it like that. Don't babes, you have to tell them what you put on the fish to marinate it, because our fish has been marinated or marinating for a while. Right here, we have some shadow Benny. We may go put tonight. Let me just do that for the, th the thumbnail picture. Um, green onions, um, carrots. Uh, this is ginger and garlic. Little bit of thyme. Some chayote squash. Jamaicans call it chocho, but you can't go ayalia to say chocho. If you say chocho in an ayalia, you get into trouble. All right? And round here, so you have some um, onions. In ayalia, this is known as chayote squash. All right? I'm just telling the fam now, don't say send to upset. Okay, go ahead now, girl. So the ingredients for the seasoning is just four simple ingredients. You have Laurie's. Laurie's seasoned salt. Black pepper. Garlic powder. Garlic powder. And... And... The big dog. Can't make a fish dish without Old Bay seasoning. Old base Straight season. out of New Orleans. Straight out of New Orleans. All right. Yeah. May I echo? So those are just the four things that you need for the fish itself. Everything else will be added when the process is going. Yes, um, Denise, it is it is fillet, but it has because it still has the tail attached to it. It is butterfly. It, it, it we just removed it. We just open it up, but it came as a butterfly. You understand what I mean? When it came, it was open up, but we just sliced it and, 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 and made it like how it is there. So, all right. So, as I said, I bought it from the fish, um, the, the meat store as a butterfly, meaning it open like, like so. Let me see if I can show you my hand. It open like this. And then we just slice down the middle. All right. But it's still attached by the tail. Okay. So the whole idea behind steam fish is pretty much to make the fish just just us uh, wait may i say steam <laughs> you're gonna blanch the fish in in its own juices yeah from my husband said that your son does not eat avocado yet he eat guacamole <laughs> oh, 
Yeah. 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 All right, and what I'm doing here is using some of the hardy vegetables to make a, a bed, all right, for the fish. Because we don't want the fish to, to um, burn. Not hot. All right, yeah, ma'am, I don't want it hot. I just want, it, we want the pot to come up to temperature on its own, oh. all right? Because I don't fry where I fry this stuff. Then we just I use oil to um, deter sticking and all of those things. Cynthia, so that's what I made for dinner yesterday. Yes, yeah, Cynthia, I hope say yours come out nice. Because our own is going to come out very nice right now. All right, may I, may I do a style right now? Because I'm all stylish. <laughs> yeah? I'm going to put some. And guys, please, we implore you. I implore you. Go ahead and give him a thumbs up. Because I was supposed to be the one cooking, but. She has shy away from the thing that guys may he tell took you. over. You don't say that, don't say that, don't say that, don't hmm? say me take over like like me like me, me, me take it from you. No, I asked well, I backed away, put it that way. She too shy shy, you know. Shy, shy. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. You must oh know you lane, you know. So I'm saying lane. He, he's better at these things. I do everything traditional. So then the traditional if you do that your version is still relevant, you know. You never know that. Mm. Your version is still relevant. Well, yeah? that means that no fish sauce wouldn't go in there, period. <laughs> no oyster sauce wouldn't go in there. Half of the stuff that you would put in now, there. Now, when you're steaming, guys, you don't have to worry about ingredients, um, sauteing and all of that. You see me? You just pretty much want to put your stuff in and make the heat do the rest. All right. And why don't you put the seasonings on the bottom of the pot? Too? Because the seasoning is very, very um delicate. It will burn. Oh, okay. Yeah, you want to. All right, and guys, you could you could stuff these, but we're not about that way. We just want nice fish to eat, not to stuff tonight. I know it. We just want it. It's a Tuesday evening, so we're in the bashment, holy bashment. Yeah. And next time we can, yeah. Keisha, good evening to you. Let me switch this one. Them pretty, man. People, are they not super duper pretty? And very fleshy. Yes. And the fish, guys, they're going to be so surprised how quick fish cooks, especially without the bones inside on the head. Alright, now I'll just put some, some pieces of that. Just you know, just to get rid of it. Alright. And immediately the fish sauce come up strong because we use fish sauce. And when you're using fish sauce in your in, in your steam fish, you don't really need no farmer salt. You know, worse if you're using a little bit of old bay or something like that. And it's all about ingredients, guys. All about mm -hmm. ingredients. And everything is done in one stage. Yeah. Everything is added. This is garlic. And you just want to put your garlic all over. And Asians, especially Asians, when they're making fish, they put ginger. So you want to put your ginger. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And immediately you smell that strong gingery flavor. Ginger works very well with steamed fish. So what do you say, is Asian inspired or is it traditional Jamaican steamed fish? Well, let me let me inspire Asian more. Okay. I'm gonna Asian it up a little bit more. Oh, okay, okay. So it's gonna be mixed with Jamaican and Asian. With this now, we're not really gonna, you know, break up the time. You can, but you know, mm -hmm. with steamed fish, again, it's more rustic. So you just wanna Add your thyme all over. How oh, it look, guys? Look like something like one. Mm -hmm. Beulah, good evening to you. Good evening, good evening. Cynthia Beckford. 
evening pauline griffiths love watching you guys cook hello from atlanta atlanta is in, in the, the house, house. Hey. georgia is in the house hey. and this is shadon benny our our culantro if you've ever heard of it or decided to use it it's something like culantro mm -hmm. but a little bit more tangy it gives a limey type of um effect to the steam fish mm -hmm. and it's a bold, it has a bold flavor a really bold flavor the next thing i'm gonna add is i poured out some of this which is asian now this is where the asian come in this is miso ginger broth that i got at trader joe's mm -hmm. and i poured out a little and now i'm just gonna add it to my steam fish and it's miso soup so it have a nice asian flavor so yeah. you're making me hungry <laughs> kim kim. hollywood's in the house florida in the house it and kim kim is in new york uh, yeah. and this is some cilantro ginger and garlic paste that i homemade mm -hmm. see there mm -hmm. yeah so if you make them thing you make it you know fill your belly with them thing yeah just you know, fresh find ingredients. all the greens that you can in your fridge and put them in your food processor right yeah with a but this oil. is cilantro and, and this is cilantro and garlic Gar and ginger. oh that's garlic cilantro and um, ginger yeah brooklyn's in the house new york in the house lone crowd lord help me with the name yellow every belly. time you know who is yellow belly yellow of course really <laughs> Yellow Big up belly on uh, not Carolina. Big up yellow belly. <laughs> Trey Sean, good evening to you. And we just add some to mm -hmm. some um some onion. Mm -hmm. I'm like onion, lots of onion. Yeah man. Yellow Only one thing now got in a this way where we would have want in it and a okra. Okay, okay. We gotta find a piece of do we have any pepper? Touch one it, but you can manage it. It depends. Are you sure? Moderately. Moderately. Not Brother Watson style. You mean I can't the people Moderate in the style. Let's lose. <laughs> <laughs> and you know. That is fish well. Is not... Sorry, go ahead. No, no, no. I was that is well flavored. Yellow steam belly. Fish is blessings. not steam fish. Sorry. Go ahead. <laughs> Steam fish is not steam fish without a little butter. Butter. <laughs> butter. And this is olive oil butter. Mm -hmm. Real genuine butter, not, not margarine or spread, butter spread or whatever they want to call it. <laughs> um Alenia looks amazing. I want to jump through the phone and eat it. Brilliant <laughs> idea. <laughs> <laughs> But guys, you know, on a Tuesday, you come in from work and you don't really want to appreciate yourself to eat, to do no extra whole for cooking. Mm -hmm. This is when you, you do something like this, you understand? And see, the wife, he took some time out and, and cut my scallions Asian style. And I'm using the white part. I'm adding the white, the scallion whites. I'll cut more. I need a lot more for like... No, I need some. Oh, need a little. Some, yeah. Somebody said that they're from... I missed it. Las Vegas in the house. Hey, Nevada is in the Nevada house. Nevada is in the house. Big up yourself, Linda. From Nevada. Big up yourself, Linda. What Linder. fish can be used? Any fish can be used, honey. But we're using snapper this in is, this case. Yeah. You can use white nin, you can use other fish. White okay. nin, you can use black nin, you can use Pink trout. Nin. You can use. Pink nin. Don't use tilapia, though. No. Don't use All right, guys, this is not normal to the dish but may i add it because right man a bad man this is powdered moringa guys and if you watch if you watch my videos you will see where i show you how to powder your moringa and i'm adding it now Let's yeah the green guys look at the green it look good you man oh the camera oh my god sure sure and if you know where moringa dead, you can put some moringa in your steam fish. Remember me tell you. All right, just put some black pepper now. And you don't want trouble, you know. 
you want this to stay and do its thing see now you're gonna show them talk to them about your amazing hair products really? let me shake the pot a little bit what fish okay delicious you can use polish vodak vodka <laughs> <laughs> you mean in the same fish okay spin the camera around now and show them your stuff all right guys i will catch up with the rest of the comments the comments are coming in by the droves guys so <laughs> but in the meantime in, in between, between time, time let me introduce you to the sponsor of this evening steam fish dinner although she not paying me <laughs> That's the sponsor. <laughs> <laughs> this evening's video is brought to you by a non other than. <laughs> but on the real though, today's video is brought to you by none other than One True Natural. True Natural is my brand this is my natural hair product line and so far in my product line i have three products that i want to introduce you guys so we have the first of all this uh, proprietary blend of a nourishing oil blend called shine of mine and it has all natural ingredients and it's a good balance of oils usually no you don't really oh, <laughs> usually some people find that some oils are too heavy for your hair some people find that some oils are too light for your hair so what i did was i took the liberty of you know combining a balanced blend of oil that will be suitable for any hair type yeah i'm looking in the wrong place so this is it a lot of ingredients grapeseed oil sweet almond oil castor oil olive oil you Lots name it research. it's in there yes and the very last but most important ingredient is lots of love and of course we have the jamaican black castor oil and this is grown in the hills of saint mary for my brand extracted no other products added no salt added authentic unadulterated jamaican black castor oil to be compared with another yes and this is very good for growth and for thickening. If you have problems with baldness, shedding, you know, thinning hair, this is the truth, guys. And of course, the little sister to that is, let me see if I'm holding it correctly. The little sister to that is my One True Natural Castor Oil Mascara. And this is simply a lash and brow treatment. Let me show you what it looks like. It's a traditional, typical wand. See, look at my lash. <laughs> you see it? It treat it. Put it on my lash and show them. No. <laughs> Put it on my lash. No. <laughs> you don't need long lashes. But yeah, this product, guys, is good for your lash and your brows for thickening and for growth. Same principle applies. It is a growth. Castor oil is good for growth and for thick thickening. And if you want, if you want, wash out. And if you want wash out yeah this this oil is all natural so it can be ingested and it is good as a laxative not for wash out we, we don't use those terms we say laxative so it's a good laxative also so for if you're so sure yeah. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> and then this now also can be used on your skin because it's all natural ingredients and it has an awesome smell because i have a secret blend of essential oils such as lemon oil i won't give you the rest of ingredients but yeah it's the bomb Balcom. yeah so this steam fish video is brought to you by one true natural you can go ahead and follow my my page my product line page at one true natural on instagram also on facebook you can shoot me an email if you have any questions one true natural at gmail.com you can also order these products on etsy etsy and it's www.etsy.com i will put it in the description 
Etsy.com slash one true natural. And if you go to the Instagram page, the shop link is right there. One click away and you are right there. All right. Yeah. So. Great. Hooray. All right, so back to the comments. Judging by the way it looks, it could be red snapper. You could probably also use yellow tail snapper. Yeah, any kind of snapper. Yes, it's, it's red snapper or lean snapper. Kingfish, yeah. Kingfish is a more hearty, hearty. yeah, foody yeah. fish. And it kingfish, could work may, kingfish, depending on how you use it, it can break. It break apart very easily because mm -hmm. it, it 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 becomes them type of fish there, you know. Somebody say you can use porgy fish. I never heard of that one. I That's never, a foreign fish. I never had snapper snake steam before. First time. Really? Are you oh serious? Oh my gosh. Where, are, where, you, where were you born? Um, Land crowd? Let me know because we got to yeah. hook you up with some steam fishes to bomb. Guys, anytime, anytime we move to, to a real house, mm -hmm. anytime we move to a real house, we're going to start invite one and two away. We um viewers to come come eat some some snapper fish and thing but through that house is so small when you drop out of the kitchen you drop in the bedroom it really can't work if three people come in here we can't we can't come out you have to back back and come out <laughs> <laughs> somebody says what's moringa fred fed dev say what's moringa moringa is a herb and this is just a prelude because as you said there's a Thorough in-depth moringa video that is coming up sometime. It's, out there, it's, out there. it's already out there. Yeah, it's out there. Okay, so yeah, you guys can check on his playlist and you will find that moringa video with the details. But it is a natural herb, correct? Yeah. That what? That is available <laughs> on the market that has a whole host of nutritious properties. Yeah. Okay, okay. Mm-hmm. And um, I always had a red snapper fry. I love red snapper fried. I was trying to advocate for it fried, but you know, I love it steamed too. Love the roses blossom. <laughs> Thank you. Um, yellow belly, so where you get it? Where you get the what, moringa? Oh, yellow belly, pick my moringa and myself, you know. Yeah, we we pick it from. My God, First of all, the, uh, you stop people, you stop people tree that people house that have it and you get it there. Otherwise, you have to go to like a farmer's market, right? Yeah, a and farmer's. they have it in the pill form. Yeah, you can buy it in the form of a pill. You can buy it already powdered. Yeah, from Amazon. If you and can, then. Yeah. Do you still have the bush? If you still have the bush? Mm -hmm. now, you, now you put on the bush. Put oh, so it down here. See, top this up. All right, so we got these green and fresh, but he started to dry it, so this is how it's looking now. Lord, please don't make it mess up the whole house. Don't take it you all can see it? Up. Yeah, this is this is it's half dried. It can't get drier than this, and then he blends it and it In gets, my magic it, bullet. Yeah, and it turns into powder. Who else now? What else? Let me see the other comments. No comments left behind, guys. <laughs> Let me see. Atlanta is in the house. Deb Diamond's in the house. Speak up yourself. Okay. I'm going to grow my son here out. We'll have to invest soon. I went over budget this month. We will wait on you. Lean crowd. No, no worries. Le and remember, guys, if you buy castor oil and you don't smell it like, smell like, like burnt nuts, mm -hmm. it's not real. Mm -hmm. And we have a testimonial from Simone Kelly saying it worked, guys. She has been a customer since 2016. Yes. Coffee's Kitchen says, I always use castor oil. I'll definitely check it out. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, I'm there. Akina the Voice, big up yourself. Dead, dead we laugh, Rev. St. Bernardine Hospital in Cali. Okay, okay. St. Bernadine, okay. big up yourself. California is in the house. Yeah, the belly, you're not easy. I'm gonna know. We mean, we, he says so many crazy stuff. I don't know which one. I love it all. Good. All right. So, it's so my good. steam fish already, you know. What is this? Do they have wet in the now? Emojis now? Long time. Are you kidding me? Thank you so much, Tess. 
we appreciate you girl for buying a emoji a super sticker bless up to you Tess, may i eat one piece of the fish i'm calling him i promise you <laughs> i'm gonna eat a piece of fish and call you by hey. your name <laughs> hallelujah <laughs> thank you girl thank you we have a farmer's market i rarely go there though you should they really have some good stuff there oh i smell pepper i smell pepper okay thanks england kina you didn't come from no england <laughs> we'll definitely support you brand thank you so much Karen Johnson. <laughs> And guys, just as our test bought a sticker, you can buy a sticker too. Uh huh. Remember, you're a number one fan. For this month, Tess is the number one fan. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Oh, you need to tell them how to buy a sticker. It's right there, where where you wherever your chat room is, mm -hmm. wherever you see the chat, you see the the sticker emoji, and where you if you click on the dollar sign, you will immediately go into it, and you can be able to buy a sticker. Buy a sticker. Hey. Sticker. Sticker. Buy a sticker, Ooh. a LOL sticker or a high five sticker. Get your sticker. <laughs> Guys, Joshua don't want to come outside. Don't say hello to him. Why am I say like that? Tell me why I'm saying like that. Although he wasn't feeling too well earlier in the week. So guys, I don't know where I'm going. Sorry, it's my face shine like pear seed. But I said go when you cook, when you chef up a thing, let me show you what I'm going right now. Look at that. Look at that, young people. Can you believe it? Look at my steam fish. It okra, guys. Let me tell you when we do the okra. When I buy okra and I have excess, I put them in a container and put them in the freezer. Always put them in the freezer. Oh, you feel your crackers and the, the steam fish not ready yet? Hmm? Thank you, T. Then we rub my hair. Sure, T. I might hear your ear she that. Miss it when she says sent to open it. She said, Love your ear, sent to. Miss it the sent to. I will see the sent to. Just give a thumbs up. Thank Cynthia you. Cynthia said that's a meal by itself. For real? Yeah. No side needed. No side. This yeah. is what you call one pot steam fish. Beautiful set look for him. Yes. I tell you, it's I'm just happening. Up. Watch it. It's just flowing. Jeez. I'm not <laughs> here, Paul is saying so everybody that for me that the fish looks so nice, sure. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Kino said round the corner. Yes, Kino, round the corner. Round the corner. Kino said my youth swimmers for me. You are waiting. No, may I put the the, 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 the fish first. Don't see. Mm -hmm. I put I put um. T O G forty four. So that look good. Put them down from what band is? Mm -hmm. Put down the, the fish on that. Mm -hmm. The height. Put fire top and fire bottom. Man. <laughs> <laughs> uh, crackers on yes, uh, top and crackers on bottom. Man. All right. No man to find the egg lift or something. It's in the drawer. Because with this type of swimmers, you can't afford to break it up. Can I get a thumbs up? Can I get a can I get a thumbs up? Can I get a can I get a can I get a woo woo? <laughs> Do you share one man? Any time food ready for share out, ladies and gentlemen. Is there anyone on the chat that doesn't know how to do a thumbs up? Just let me know and I will give you a tutorial. Yes, please give if them. No, just say I don't know. Or, give them the tutorial. IDK. All right, sure you know what me have to do now. I have to take out my, my snapper. Me 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 okra them <laughs> out of the way. Cause me no want the okra impede the the um the process. The process. So I'm putting my okra on my plate, mm -hmm. you know, and I'm look for the little soft one them because some of them okra I look too big. Mm -hmm. I want the little soft one them. Can you know I hear, I hear a plate this may I share out, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you hear the baby vice all of a sudden come in, but anytime you hear food, baby vice. Mm -hmm. And I dance again for baby vice. Dancing on baby vice. <laughs> Alright, now I'm going to remove some of them okra out of the way because I want my steam fish to, to be nice and turned. 
All right. See the steam feed. Oh lord, it's breaking up, guys. It's breaking up. Breaking Kino, transmission. Kino, say how far now come from me? Where Kino say? How far now come from? Him from, still not reach. From Grand Spain Road. <laughs> Tell him say him still not reach. How far I come from? What did not reach yet? Watch me now. Watch Osh, me now. Osh Simone, Simone say our Wi-Fi keep kicking her out at work. Oh jeez, I feel it for you, Simone. I'm gonna buy you a hotspot. We're gonna buy you a hotspot. When your the belly TV get big, we shall buy you your hotspot. We shall buy you a hotspot. When your the belly get, get big, big, we shall buy you a hotspot. <laughs> so you can watch this something with we. <laughs> <laughs> No, so and guys, don't sleep on all that long water you see in the pot. Oh no, that oh no, juice? that's for crackers. That's crackers Man. juice. I like the top of the fish and the top part of the fish. I like it. I feel like more I'm putting it in your plate. And if you have some for the presentation, I like this. Yes, this Do you know that there. Asians would drink this like a soup? Yeah, me too. Mm. <laughs> that's why I'm an Asian. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like all this look. Wow. That's yeah. incredible. Yep. I'm gonna get some 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 soup now. Mm-hmm. Guys. It's time for the, the soup in. We are come down to the come down now. Nice. Who like what I go on so far? You have to put enough gravy in you know, because crackers there at the bottom. Oh, yeah. Uh huh. We're doing that thing. <laughs> <laughs> All of a sudden, hearing singing and going on around beside me, guys. And, and me guys, I wonder. Just, just to say that you can, if you want to make this a one pot meal, you could have just popped some broccoli in there, right, babe? Yeah, it it not need nothing more. Honestly, it don't need nothing more. If you want to put broccoli, that's your business, but mm-hmm. it don't really need. Not like if you're not going up. with the crackers or whatever, and you want something more mm-hmm. filling, then you can pop whatever you want to pop in the pot. Right. I wanted to pop some shrimp in the pot too, but I'm too spoiled. Can you hear guys? So I'm saying. She wants shrimp too. Eh? Almost something you want one. Hmm? And guys, beg him with me. I'm trying to get him to do a seafood boil for me. Oh my gosh. I love seafood boils. You love seafood boils? Mm-hmm, but only when you make it. All right, I'm gonna just flavor it up a little bit. Add a little bit more salt just to, you know, blow it up a little bit. Mm. You want more crackers in it? Are you good with that cracker? Maybe you should make one of that thing to go on top instead of the time. You know how they curl the thingy thing thing? What thingy thing thing? That one little curled skeleton thingy. Oh, yes, I look good. Yes, guys. Yes, guys. Hold on. Wait a minute. Let me show you what's going on in there. I overdo it now. I overdo it. I overdo it. Hmm? Yellow belly say I'm ready to eat. Candy <laughs> said good job. <laughs> Guys, watch your man. Look them man. Watch your man. <laughs> I feel crying. Ardent defender. What go on Ardent? A long time. I'm see you on in the Ardent. And we be looking out for you, bruh. Mem, yeah, you're the twanging. It's up to you. It's up to you, my girl. It's up to you. Up to you. Kim, Kim, see that Kim. Yeah. Next time I come a New York, Kim, just find the fish and make we steam it. Don't a, don't a, um, wait me in that place. Don't a favor shop. Watch it. Watch it. Just caught the end. I need to make it for my Jamaican husband. He's hard to please. Send him round a yard belly TV. <laughs> Send your Jamaican husband around to Yard Belly TV, Tanya Kai, and see what happened. Mm, could it, could it, could it, could it? Steam fish and okra. 
I'm feeling it in my heart. <laughs> <laughs> And guys. guys, remember, I'm tell you, this can be done very, very quickly. Yeah? Arden says he's been busy, busy at work, traveling and working. Arden, you travel soon? Come, I'm going to be in a suitcase. I'm going to travel to you now. We're a long time when I travel. Tanya says, I'm done cook. I'm not cook and I'm hard for please. Tell the man to <laughs> go learn how to cook, but, but he doesn't cook. <laughs> if you don't cook, you can't tell people what to do. <laughs> But guys, trust me, one pot meal, healthy meal. If you are if you are diabetic, for instance, and you can't deal with the wallipa starch, just remove some of the, the, the crackers. Mm -hmm. You understand? If you have high blood pressure, just don't put an extra salt. Mm -hmm. But this is good quality food. And remember now you want to eat this in the low afternoon. You don't want to go too late in the night because fish take long for digest. But overall, it is way better and healthier than the animal protein. Yeah? And a good food, okay. and the, the wife can't wait for eating. You know, some men don't know what happened because the video soon done right now because she can't wait to eat. Let me take a picture. Yeah, throw some crackers in that gravy over your side. Now. We're, we're just gonna take a couple pictures for his Instagram, Amsterdam, Instagram. And remember, you can find me on Instagram at Yardy Belly TV. Mm -hmm. And the wifey at one true natural mm -hmm. and Josh the real at Josh, Josh the food, food lover. lover. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Denise, thank you. So it looked good. That's a beautiful dish. Thanks, Linda. Looks so tasty. Yes, yes, yes. Let me take a picture now. No, sir. <laughs> And this is how you utilize up your Jamaican stuff, yeah? In the house, make sure that's a beautiful dish. Hallelujah. Feel it. I feel it. Let me show you how I go on my pot, you know. Look for my pot, guys. Remember me tell you? Yes. <laughs> I'm just using these crackers to soak up the remainder of the juices. <laughs> it makes me want to cry the way the pot look good, too. <laughs> Who like my pot? <laughs> <laughs> oh, the pot looks so good. Yeah, that's a beautiful dish. Looks so tasty. Linda, thank you so much. What happened? Hmm? I lost the picture. Okay. You lost the picture? Mm -hmm. I feel it for you. My heart cries. Um, You know, that you lost the picture guys this is a great way to have something in the afternoon that you don't have to spend a whole lot of time preparing it is our original jamaican style steam fish of course we use some butterfly fillets um yellow snap red red snapper but guess what it works it really works so until we do this again remember to join us on thursday morning for breakfast live yes guys and this thursday we're taking it up a notch you know where breakfast is gonna be from the far orient yes at food welcome with this thursday all right so remember now if you don't know what to do and you want to learn remember to turn your hand and make fashion live and laugh Cook and eat and join us on Yadi Belly TV for more delicious dish such as these. <laughs> hoo hoo hoo! Hot color loo, burn dog. A joke. I just that was just for the Instagram guys. I'm just letting you know that was just for the Instagram. <laughs> well, see, you need to talk to your people. Let them know what's up. Yeah. No, the video is pretty much done, guys. We're gonna if the, all the videos not going we're not gonna keep you for our every time. Yeah, Some we're, of the, the dishes are we're just about out of time. So once again, thank you so much for joining us, guys. The wife want to dig in, and we are making sure that we don't keep you too long. It's been a beautiful evening, and we love you all, manners and respect. And we shall talk again pretty soon. 
say something and remember you. guys we are imploring you that if you have a dish request that you want us to try to make or you know want us to cook be sure to either leave it in a comment or you know just shoot us a quick message to say you're the better tv i need you to cook some liver and onions or i needed to cook some calamaris or i needed to make some frog legs whatever it is that you <laughs> Whatever it is that you want us to make, we are taking requests. All right? Yeah. Tanya says she had to send him over because they live in Miami. Mm. <laughs> You're right. Tanya Johnson said, No, our husband wants this. She have to go to a, a fish shop. Hush, <laughs> 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 Tanya. Hush. Mr. Johnson, leave the lady alone. If she lives in Miami, we can't tell her. Tea, to big up yourself. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. T says she got to eat. Bless up to you. Denise um, says, Steam Bami would have go great with that. Yeah, the um, yellow bell is a very beautiful blue. Beulah blessings, big up yourself, girl. Remember me tell you, trust me. Oh, you can you watch this video again? Well, Tanya, what's gonna happen is as soon as we are finished with the live, it's gonna go into my playlist, and you can look for it in the playlist called um, Taste Buds. Okay, so it's gonna be on the on the, the the page still, so you don't have to worry. Tanya says she want banana fritters next. Mm. Tanya, you're gone right up the wifey Holly. Mm -hmm. Yes, she is gonna be there preparing that banana fritters for you. All right, so and please, guys, check out some of the videos that we have. Our playlist is extended. Um, it's long. We have a lot of videos. We have vegan food. We have vlogs that we've been on the road. Our anniversary and stuff like that. A little bit of our family will show in the in the vlogs as well. So I know most of you are here for the recipe, but hey. We you can fast in our business it's a package yeah. it's a package yes mm -hmm. yes yes and so i'm just right now i'm going into the food food porn industry all right that's beautiful but you know you're the food porn now put on your red dress step in your eye heel some of that sweet perfume right it sure look good on you put on your lipstick yeah and make your hair come down hey, hey. cause when you smell the food mm -hmm. it's gonna make you drool <laughs> <laughs> blessings y'all guys love y'all respect 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 mm -hmm. no frog legs <laughs> duly noted denise duly noted all right guys so until next time we are Signing, signing out hilarious as usual <laughs> we're gonna be signing out and remember to keep it locked we might come before thursday if not it's thursday we might morning. forward we might forward nobody not to know when we come that's so not appropriate <laughs> right now that's so inappropriate yeah <laughs> the point of the matter is keep it locked because you don't want to miss out because when him head take him him go live Tomorrow we are going live. Tomorrow we are going live. Love you too, yellow belly. <laughs> Pauline Griffin. You see, Pauline, you is a troublemaker, Pauline. You don't come on for the whole evening as Miss certain things. She was on. Oh, she was on. Yeah, oh, man, she was oh, on. Oh, oh. All right, Pauline. I'll leave you alone. <laughs> you're, not, you're not logging off the blog. All right, guys. Thanks for joining us live, guys. Peace.